pharmacist is, if you like, really an expert in drugs and to become a pharmacist you need to study um, a four year MPharm degree um, and then complete a, a pre-registration year which is under the supervision of a qualified pharmacist. At the School of Pharmacy here we have a, an MPharm curriculum um, and the really interesting thing about that for me is the fact that it's so wide and varied. It's, it's a curriculum which um, there's a lot of science, um, so pharmacists need to know about how drugs work, how medicines are formulated, but as well as that, they need to be able to deal with people, they need to know about how people behave, how people, um, what affects people's health, um, they need to know about legislation, um, how legislation governs the supply of drugs. In the MPharm curriculum, we um, don't just focus on developing knowledge, we um, develop skills alongside that and um, this centre, this area here is an area where we allow students to develop hands-on skills, dealing with patients, and doing a little bit of physical examination, those sorts of things um, and we would help them in developing those or they allow them to develop those by going out on placement, so visiting pharmacies, short visits to pharmacies um, to help develop those skills. Um, most people will be familiar with community pharmacists, this, this background here will be familiar to lots of people. Um, pharmacists also work in lots of different areas of practice. Um, there are hospital pharmacists, there are pharmacists involved in, in formulating medicines within industry. There are pharmacists like myself who teach. Um, there are people who work in regulatory um, involved in the of medicines, developing legislation, so there are lots of different career opportunities that we 